Hi, I'm Peter Edwards from Blue Tutors. Um, we teach children of all ages, um, right from primary school to degree level, and we find the highest quality tutors. Um, and today, I'm going to teach you some maths. We're now going to look at how to convert a binary number to a hexadecimal number. Um, so up here, I've, I've written two binary numbers, and we're going to look at how to convert both of those. Um, the important thing to note about um, a binary number and a hexadecimal number is that they're actually related in quite an interesting way. Um, so the first four digits of a binary number will decide the first digit of a hexadecimal number. The reason for that is that with four digits of a binary number, you can represent in decimal the numbers 1 to 15. Um, and similarly with a hexadecimal number, the first digit can represent in decimal the numbers 1 to 15. So, let's look at this, this first number and let's work out what it is in hexadecimal. Um, so it's a binary number. Um, this column is 2 to the 0, 2 to the 1, 2 squared and 2 cubed. What I mean by that is that um, this 1 means that we have uh, two, essentially 2 to the power of 0, which is 1. Um, this 0 means we have no 2s whatsoever. This 1 means we have 1, 4 and this one means we have one eight. Um, so if we convert that into decimal, we have eight plus four plus zero plus one, which is 13. And in hexadecimal, this is represented by D, because um, once we get to nine, we then have uh, 10 is A, 11 is B, 12 is C, and 13 is D. Okay, so that, that's a simple example to start with. We're now going to move on to a slightly more complicated example. So again, remember, each of the four digits represents a number in the hexadecimal system. Um, and we have this one on its own. Um, so, let's look at the, the first four digits of this decimal number. Um, we have one, which represents eight, and another one, which represents four and then two zeros, which is equal to 12, and in hexadecimal that's represented by C. Um, let's look at the next one. We have no eights, we have one four, no twos, and a one, which is five. And of this last one, we just have one. So we have one, five, and C. So in hexadecimal, this number is represented by one, five, C. And that is how to convert a binary number to a hexadecimal number.